Good morning, welcome back to another vlog. Happy Thursday. I'm home in Minnesota if you've been keeping up with the last couple of vlogs. And it's been so nice being home and just like truly slowing down. I haven't really vlogged much, so I decided to pick up the camera today and kind of bring you guys through the next couple days of my life. We have a busy day today and tomorrow, seeing some friends and everything, so I'm excited. But we're starting off the morning with an Orange Theory workout. My mom and I just got here, so we're gonna head on in. Got the workout in today. It's the 12 minute run, and I don't think my mom knows. I know she doesn't know, so it'll be a tough workout, but solid way to kick off the Thursday. proud of myself because I hit my PR on the tread and I was running it was like the six minute and I'm like you know what I've never I don't know how I got my initial best record in 12 minutes and then I made it because your mom was there watching yeah my mom had her eyes on me just kidding no I didn't but that's just believe in yourself you know when I'm on the treadmill I always like give myself little affirmations I'm like I can do this I do too I say I'm an athlete yeah. I do, I say that to myself. I know, you said that, and I, ever since you said that, I take it in. Oh, yeah. I know. But mom didn't even know it was the 12 minute uh, no. bench. <laughs> I kept it a secret from you. And not to say she did the two and a half minute plank. Oh yeah, I did That's that too. That's pretty cool. Solid work, Solid. girl. Solid. Strong cores. Okay, we're heading into Target to pick up a couple of groceries, and then we'll head home, make some breakfast, and get the rest of the day going. You guys know this breakfast is my current fixation. I made some scrambled eggs with chicken sausage, and then on the side, I always need a little sweet tooth, so I did a cottage cheese with some cinnamon and granola on top. So good. It's been a couple hours since I last vlogged. My sister and I literally just went to the dentist. You can pop it open. Okay, sweet. Let's try it. What is it? What flavor? It's the rain rainbow sherbet. See oh, what they did there? Good job. Slay. But we both just got our teeth cleaned at the dentist. <laughs> now we're like energy drink. Energy. Wait. I hey, actually, we didn't go to Starbucks, so that's a that's a good play. Isn't that Ooh, really good? It's actually pretty good. I would say I would only be able to do a couple sips. Yeah. Anyways, fun. now that we have fresh pearly whites, we're gonna go to the mall. I'm so pumped to go to the Mall of America. Minnesota doesn't have sales tax on their clothes, so that is some good news. We don't. No. How did I so like if a shirt is twenty eight dollars, it's twenty eight dollars. Whereas in Florida, it'd be like twenty nine fifty or like thirty really? thirty twenty seven. We made it to the homeland, aka the mall, aka shop until we drop, aka shop until we drop. No sales tax. We love it. I just watched the Kardashians, so that's my ultimate go to. That's your inspo right now. Mm -hmm. Layla and I shopping together is the most dangerous combo ever. Oh my gosh, it's so we should get L's. So cute, but we don't take L's. We take M's. <laughs> we take W. We take does. What do you want? Wait, I love Bobble Bar's jewelry though. Bobble Bar? Bobble Bar. Bobble Bar. I think that. And it's on sale. I kind of love this gingham set. Right? Isn't that so pretty? I know. So cute. Lale's first Aritzia purchase. We're at the Nike store and obviously I put Lael on to literally my favorite shoe ever. You guys know I rave about these. They're yeah, so cute. You guys, and I'm really picky. Like I'm really That's picky what I said. I'm so picky about the sneakers that I wear, especially for strength training. And these are it. Boring. I could be right now. I know. Okay. What a successful little mall trip. We ended up Hitting a couple stores. Aritzia still had their summer sale and it was so good. I ended up finding a pair of jeans for $40, which is like unheard of from Aritzia. So I'm getting those shipped to my mom's house. So I'll have those before I head back to Florida. That was so fun. I know. They all found some new shoes. I got a new sports bra because I freaking love these from Nike. This bright pink one mm. is so good. I really like that one. Right? Isn't it cute? I wish they had the matching leggings, but I think they're only online. But yeah, now Lael's about to drop me off at Crave, meeting with my friend Marietta, and I'm so excited. They have like the best sushi. I shouldn't say the best sushi. They just have really, really good sushi and they don't have Crave like anywhere else besides Minnesota. So every time I come home, I get so excited for it. And truffle fries. Oh yes, their truffle fries are bomb. Yes, those are like a must have, but I think their sushi is honestly up there. Yeah, I, I would say their sushi is pretty high up there too. Good 
morning, you guys. I just got ready for Orange Theory this morning. There's a new Orange Theory that opened up near my dad's house, so I decided I'd head there this morning. I'm just wearing a sports bra from Nike, and then these leggings, which have become one of my favorite styles of leggings. They're the Nike Zenvi. So freaking comfy, and then my new on cloud sneakers. Bye, Dad, love you. so much later i've been the worst at vlogging today but pretty much after orange theory this morning i came back got a little bit of work done and then my friend and i went for a walk and we also got lunch afterwards and it was so nice to catch up with her it's so crazy just like how many different stages your friends are at in life and like in your 20s because she just got engaged and like i don't know it's crazy i have friends that are married friends that are gonna be engaged soon and it's so exciting to see all of your friends just like in such exciting stages of life and like just learning about everything because I don't know anything about that stuff so we caught up for a bit and then I came home got a little bit more work done kind of wrapping some things up because today is actually Friday so I just wanted to get everything all squirted away and ready to go before the weekend and now I'm getting ready because we're going to dinner tonight but it's on the other side of town it's one of my favorite spots but sadly, it is really crappy weather out. Like, it's just really windy, super gloomy. It's a bummer because where we're going is like such a vibe when it's super nice out. It's one of my favorite spots to go in the summer. So I was considering bailing. <laughs> but I'm like, when am I home in Minnesota? And like, I don't know when I'll be back. So might as well just like take advantage of it. And we'll still make the most of what we got. It's just way more fun when it's obviously like nice out because it's basically primarily outside but they do have really good food so that's always nice we're either gonna go there or this other place called grocer's table which is one of my favorite restaurants but again it's much more of a vibe when it's nice out we'll still have fun and everything but i have no idea what i'm wearing tonight i'm kind of trying to brainstorm while i'm getting ready also my skin when I travel home, I swear my skin goes nuts. And same with my eyebrows. I need to get them waxed. I've been meaning to do that while I'm home. My eyebrows and a pedicure. Maybe we'll do that like Monday before I leave. Because oh, let me tell you, these brows need some shaping. But I'm going to quickly finish up my makeup. I just straightened my hair a bit. And then we'll figure out an outfit and head on out. Just about to head out, just finished getting ready. Here's a little fit check. This top is from Revolve, the brand Super Down, and then some Zara jeans, a little belt, purse, and some sandals. Very casual, but this top, I wish I had fashion tape because it is definitely a little sliding around, so we'll have to be a little extra cautious. Good morning, you guys. Happy Saturday. I just got to Orange Theory this morning. My mom and I are getting a workout in, starting off the Saturday on the right foot. Last night was a very chill night, honestly. We went to this restaurant called Urban Eatery, and it's like a newer restaurant, and we were gonna eat there, but the service was so freaking slow, and it wasn't busy at all, so we ended up just going to Maynard's, eating there, and then honestly coming on home because we were both so, so tired. But it was a good, much needed chill night, honestly. And today, I don't really know what the plan is. We'll kind of figure it out as we go. It's just so incredibly humid out, but nothing I'm not used to, okay? The Florida weather got me prepped for this humidity, that's for sure. up the workout this morning it was a 3g style class which i haven't done in a long time so it means you're like 15 minutes on the rower 15 minutes on like the treads 15 on the floor but it was good it's always so much faster when i work out with my mom like we just get her done we worked out with her and her boyfriend so that was fun but it was definitely a tough one my knee has been bothering me so i think i'm gonna go to the chiropractor while i'm home which would be super nice but I don't know what's the deal. Anyways, we're gonna go home, freshen up, make some breakfast. I have a little bit of work that I wanna get done and kinda just get some things sent over, even though it's Saturday. Sometimes I work on the weekends pretty much all the time. Like I said, it is so incredibly hazy out and smoky. Whoops, 
so you're not like supposed to breathe air <laughs> that sounds so harsh but literally you're not supposed to be outside because the air quality is really bad today but anyways we'll figure it out i'm so excited we're heading out this morning to go grab the boat and then we're gonna spend the day on the lake which will be so nice just stopped to grab some caribou this morning which i'm so excited because usually caribou is like one of my first stops every time i come home i love it it's way better in my opinion than starbucks but not in florida it's like a very midwest type of thing i feel like it's the duncan on the east coast but like caribou for the midwest if that makes sense i got you uh well they didn't have zivia or zivia or whatever this is all they had for sugar and then i got you a cold brew oh, no, with a good. splash of almond milk it's different every time Welcome to Caribou. Do you have a rewards account with us? I do. Could I just get a small crafted press with light ice and almond milk instead, please? Thank you so much. Yes. Good morning, you guys. Happy Monday. I just finished up my workout this morning at Orange Theory and I'm heading home. I have a busy day ahead. I have an interview this morning. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to treat myself to a little crafted press this morning so good and today i have some things that i'd love to get done like my laundry my eyebrows i need to get waxed so badly and i'd love to get myself a pedicure because i've been wanting to do that for a long time and then i have some work to get done so lots of running errands getting work done that kind of stuff typical monday vibes you guys know the drill but then i leave tomorrow night to head back home and i'm excited to get back to tampa though because i feel like i've done my time here you know like i've had the vibes and it's been so nice being home and so relaxing which i needed but i'm excited to get back to tampa and also it literally feels like fall time here it's so windy and it's probably like low to mid 70s which i really like it is a nice break from the heat but it's so weird because it just makes me feel like it's fall out you know Couple hours later i'm back in the car and i'm running some errands right now i'm gonna go to target and tj maxx and then i have a nail appointment at three so i just kind of wanted to knock out some errands kill some time before the appointment i'm gonna get a pedicure which will be so nice i haven't gotten one in i don't even know the last time i did that but the interview went really well this morning i also got some work done for a while but the only bummer with the position that i interviewed for is that it is an on-site position but the guy's gonna like chat with the social media team and see if they'll be able to work out a hybrid position so that i only have to go into the office like once a week otherwise that definitely would not be in the cards for me because the office is in Boca which is four hours away from where I live in Tampa so ideally they'll be able to work something out and make it like a remote slash hybrid position which would be so amazing and ideal but anyways I just wanted to give you all the update I'm gonna go run my errands and kind of just have myself a little afternoon I'm back home. It's so much later, but I got my toes done. Definitely much more relaxing and less time consuming than getting my nails done because these take me ages. They don't take me ages. They take the guy ages. You can't even be on your phone or anything. So I just did that. I uploaded a video while I was getting them done. And now I'm going to make some dinner tonight. I think we might go do a little bit of shopping at the outdoor mall in a little bit. Kind of figuring out what we're going to do. is so cute i love this top i wish they had the matching shorts though so i'm gonna try on the green set okay i actually love the green one this is so freaking cute these are the matching shorts i'm definitely gonna size up in these though i got a two so i think i'm gonna do a four because they're a little too short on the booty but these are so cute
better feeling than coming home to your own bed. I'm so excited to go to sleep tonight, but I just showered and everything, and I'm gonna crawl into bed and end off the vlog here. But I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.